Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you how I got my hair from full on blonde to brunette. Last video I posted was on these extensions and I needed hair extensions to complete this whole look. Uh, these are from E. Litchi. They're 100% uh, Remy Human hair so you can dye them. Uh, style them, wash them um, because they're real hair. So today I wanted to show you how I dyed my hair. So the products that I used are from E Salon. I'm pretty sure you guys have heard about this brand. So I ordered these sprays. Basically they are uh, temporary they are not permanent hair dyes because I just wanted to see how my hair looked brown before fully committing to brown hair if you're blonde you know going brunette is a big deal because it took me a long time to get my hair this light I am naturally a level three which is pretty dark so today i have uh by the way this video is not sponsored they did not send these to me i purchased these with my own money because i wanted to see how my hair looked brown so i thought that these were perfect so i got the color black which i'm glad i did because the hair extensions look very very dark as you guys can see so I got one color black and uh, I love how they come in these little baggies. I actually got one half price because if you go on Elle Bang's uh, review on these products, she has a discount code but it's only for one spray only but it's better than nothing. I'll link that video uh, that she did where the link is to get one half price. Uh, so the next two shades I got dark brunette. So I got uh, black and dark brunette. So I'm going to remove my hair extensions. These are the Zala hair extensions. They're uh, 20 inch. And uh, I paid a lot for these hair extensions, you guys. I paid 400 bucks, $400 Canadian. You know, sprays around camera gear, lighting, cell phones, it's not the best thing ever. So I'm gonna go in with dark brunette first. it's going to be dark enough it's not like the best to cover out Oh my god, this is very dark. But I'm gonna just start combing through a little. So I think I need to cover my face and everything because my hands are getting dirty. Ugh. So I have to say that the texture of my hair is feeling not that great.
All right, guys, I have to go and touch up. Maybe I'll do black here on the bottom. I'm not sure. Okay, so it's kind of hard to work with this thing, with these, um, you know what this reminds me of? Of those, um, uh, what, what were those? Like Halloween hairsprays. So, so I think I'm gonna just focus on the top for now. So it seems to have dried. Get my comb here. I have to say that the texture of my hair is weird. It's literally like as if I applied hairspray all over my hair. So I'm just gonna focus on the top first and then move on to the bottom. So it, it's looking a little scary right now, but it'll come together. Oh my God, that is so dark. I think I could have gone with the lighter shade, lighter than dark brunette. So I just wanna comb through this mess. And then I will focus on the bottom. All right, guys, so I'm just going to finish off or finish up off camera and then I'll be right back because I'm staining everything. I'm going to go into the bathroom and finish this off. So, <laughs> You guys, I'm back and I ran out of spray. So... <laughs> There are some spots that are still blonde. And this is definitely not made to apply all over your hair because it literally feels like hay. It feels like I um, have a wig on. A very cheap wig synthetic wig on <laughs> like it feels like I put tons of spray like it feels like I put 10 bottles of hairsprays on my hair right now this is kind of a fail look at this I find that a lot of the hair dye just got wasted and I'm glad I put a uh, paper towel because this got everywhere. I just don't really recommend using this to apply all over your hair because yeah, it's it's not moving. So I don't want to keep touching it because I don't want to reveal the mess that's going on. You know what? It's hard to find a temporary brown hair color. Like I've looked everywhere. Um, also like those brands that do crazy color like Lime Crime, Bozy, like uh, Bozy, my cat, Bo, Bo, my cat is sad because my boyfriend left. Yeah, so this is how I turned my hair. I wanted brown. A dark brown but it looks full-on black and I got the color dark brown dark brunette and black honestly the dark brunette and black looks identical uh, okay you guys so um, if you guys know of a temporary um, brown hair dye let me know something that washes off obviously because I I do want to try 
two cow brunette but this is full on black and i don't know if i like it so uh, let me know in the description box for you guys because i want to know so yeah i guess this is good for like covering some spots but like i mentioned earlier for full-on a hair color no and i see a lot of um brands that have this type of uh spray hair dye but uh, i think if you have to cover some root areas i think it's it's good for that but like i said not for all over the hair so yeah uh yeah you guys thank you so much for watching make sure you watch my hair extension video because i got some dark hair extensions i'll link the video down below so yeah thank you so much for watching you guys and i hope to see you in my next video i will let you know if this washes off or not